uh, the name of interpreter is very bad in Afghanistan. People hate, especially my relatives, especially those they know that I work for British forces, for Croatian forces. We jeopardize our lives because we stand with them. They carry their missions. We save their lives. Lots of times we carry the icons. That was like radio. So we hear what, what the Taliban saying in front of us. What, what is their plans? And then we pass uh, the message to them that there is ambush, there is enemy. They're planning to hit, they're planning to target us. So they, then they change their decision, then they change their strategy. For terrorists, like for Taliban, Daesh and ISIS, they will take their revenge. So they will kill us, they will cut our heads. Because of my past background, because of my past service with British forces. Some have been under considerable danger, which is why we were the only nation already to have in place a scheme. Uh, Americans recognize uh, the debt that we owe to those who, uh, who put their lives at risk on behalf of the United States. Uh, Washington is very, very focused on that process to try to speed that up uh, as they have provided additional staff to us here temporarily to help us work through the backlog. We recognize this commitment absolutely. It's a moral obligation. It is one of my highest priorities here as ambassador. They will kill us. They're not asking whether you work for one day or what you have done with you and this. I was planned to go to Europe countries before COVID, but when the COVID started, I was unable to go. This is my uh, the biggest regret to serve with the U.S. government in Afghanistan.